Hey, what's up guys? So today I wanted to do a detailed breakdown of how to rock the runway. I'm here with my brother Smith and together we're going to show you every step you need to be aware of, what to do with your hands, what to do with your feet, what to do with your face. So check it out. All right, so the very first thing you need to keep in mind when you're getting ready to walk down the runway is that you need to pull your pants up. Pull your pants up so that way your legs look longer, you can take more longer, comfortable strides. Second thing you wanna keep in mind is that you wanna make sure that your pockets are completely empty. Um, having stuff in your pocket while you're walking down the runway is uh, very unprofessional and it's very distracting as well. You know, you don't wanna look, you don't want to make it seem like you have a bulge in your pocket or in your hip or anything like that. So just make sure that those pockets are flat and completely empty. So second thing you want to keep in mind before you take your first walk is you want to make sure that your back is straightened up because a lot of guys tend to hunch over without even knowing. So you want to make sure that those back is completely straight. You want to relax your shoulders, take a deep breath, and then you begin to walk. Another common mistake that guys do a lot is that they don't know what to do with their hands. Uh, maybe they lift a lot of weight so they end up walking uh, with, their, with their arms far apart from their body. Um, another thing that guys do is that they swing their arms way too much. Or another mistake is that they keep their hands glued to their body and they almost look robotic while they're walking. So you want to be mindful of this. Try to walk very naturally and comfortably. You want to feel comfortable because if you feel awkward, then your walk is going to look awkward. Another mistake that guys make when they're walking down the runway is that they point their toes outwards while they're walking down the runway. So it almost makes it look like they're cowboys as they're walking. Another tip is to make sure you take long, steady strides. Uh, don't take short strides, take longer strides and make sure that they're uh, at a good pace that feels comfortable to you. Make sure it feels natural and just, you know, just walk like you're, like you're walking down the streets. Another mistake that a lot of novice models make while they're walking down is that they bob their heads way too much for the walk. So it looks kind of funny. You want to make sure that your face and your head is like pointed to one direction. Keep it steady, keep it natural. Lastly, another mistake that models make while they're walking down the runway is that they don't have a focal point as they're walking down. When you're walking down the runway, you have to keep in mind that your picture is being taken at every second. So you want to look fierce, you want to look intense, you want to look just like a model. So it's ideal to have a focal point down at the end of the runway, usually to the main camera. Just look right above the main camera and just keep your eye, eyes focused on that point as you walk down the runway. Um, be fierce, be steady, be confident, and your walk is going to look as such. Another thing to keep in mind is that when you get to the end of the runway, you want to make sure that you know exactly what you're doing with your feet. So what you want to do is that you want to keep it very quick, very simple, one, two step. Don't make it complicated. So what you want to do is that you get to the end of the runway and you do, you stop, pose, pose, one, to turn. So now Smith is going to do the same thing. Go ahead. Let's get to the end of the runway. Pose. Pose. One, two, turn. Simple. All right, guys, so there you have it. Hopefully by watching this video, you feel more confident and you can actually go out there and rock the runway. Um, if you like this video, share it with your friends and give us a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. See you next time.